Warney, fast forward. Some teams are good at chasing, other teams are not. The muscle memory, the importance of Australia having achieved the chase at Edgbaston, it feels like a long time ago, but it's the start of this series. We saw England chase about this tally on the fourth day, at, when I say this tally, 250-odd uh, in what became the final day there. But from an Australian perspective, how important is it that they've already actually done this in the series? Oh, I, think, I think confidence is everything when you're, you're winning games of cricket. Uh, it's just on the back of you know two performances at Headley and Manchester where they haven't been quite right. And, and up until today, they haven't been quite right, but they found something. And I think it's a, a huge strength that Australia may have that they might just find it at the right time. They found it at Edgbaston, uh, they managed to find it at Lords. Uh, and if they find it here and win 3 1, it'll be a remarkable series victory because, let's be honest, for the most part of this series, they've been taking some brutal blows from this England side. England just come out swinging and they've been kind of catching Australia with quite a few of those punches. And Australia have suddenly just hung in there. They've kind of hung, taken the towel out, damped themselves down, had a bit of water, and away they've gone. It's. Uh, it's a, it's a brilliant end to an amazing series and you know it wouldn't surprise me if it's a, a, an absolute nipper going down the wire patty cummins will be batting once again you know there'll be a partnership or two uh, there'll be a drop catch or two there'll be a run out chance or two uh, i think we're going to have the the ending to a series that's been very very special